Hey everybody, this is gonna be a super fast video. I gotta take care of this, and I wanna take this off my to-do list. So, let's get to it. Adding in health to Home Assistant is super easy. We're gonna just load up the configuration.yaml. I'm gonna look for a good spot here. And I'm just gonna add in system. There's no additional options. If we look at the component page, there's no additional options, just system health. And then we can start looking at the data once I restart it. So let's go ahead and do that. Our configuration, server control, restart. Now we're gonna go back to developer tools and refresh. Now we have some system health, basically giving us versions. I think the most important piece of information we have here is that we are running Docker, that we are not running Hass.io and our Python version. These are all great pieces of information. As Home Assistant continues to mature and evolve, these internal components are super useful for support. So when you're having issues, a user can go to this, go to this component, go to this page, in development and then be able to know what version they're running, if they're running SIO and all the various pieces. So this is a great step forward towards 1.0.